what's up y'all welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time here my name is diana and we're installing a wig that i got from sun bella hair all the information for this hair will be in the description box below so this beauty here is a 26 inch 220 density 13 by 4 lace um frontal as you can see here and it's also a tape lace so it has the two taped sides the lace is pre-cut it is pre-bleached it has the comb in the back and it's on a dome cap like this and it comes with a strap on here for some extra security and as well as these combs on the sides um, and then also the comb at the back so yeah this wig is really cute look at these curls in here and it's super thick and beautiful um just really quickly this is what comes in the box so they give you a few goodies like this wig cap here to install your wig a um oh some cute little makeup brush like i didn't see it before some cute makeup brushes this wig band and then um these lashes here so uh, if you want to see me install this wig let's go ahead and get into the video <music> So first thing first, I'm going to go ahead and remove my wig cap and I'm going to slick back my edges. I'm using my edge booster, um, edge wax, and my brush here. I'm just going to slick them back. And then I'm just going to slide on the wig cap like so like that and then I'm gonna pull it back. So it can like smooth back my edges probably while my hair is receding but anyways so now i'm just using my cream makeup that i got from ruby kisses and my flat top brush and i use both colors that's in this palette and just mix them together and i'm just going to press it into the wig cap to turn it into like a brownish color or whatever this step is completely optional you don't have to use a wig cap i know a lot of people prefer not to but i just like to because it makes my braids feel neater underneath the wig and now it's time to gather this beauty right here and prepare it for install um, first i'm just adjusting the adjustable band at the bottom putting it on one of the loops and then i'm going to cut this back lace because i don't ever um, use this so i just cut it off with some scissors next i'm just taking the wig band and sliding it behind my head and i'm going to slide the wig on it's very very simple i'm just tucking in that back comb and then i'm just going to adjust it so it sits right on my forehead and um make sure it fits comfortably around my ears so i noticed that it was like the lace was sitting on top of my ears a little bit so right now i'm just pinning up my hair and i'm just going to take some scissors really quickly and cut the lace like slightly so that it can so that the lace can come like in front of my ears um and not hang over it like what you see here and now it's going to be time to install the tape the um, point is to separate the blue part from the sticky part you may need to use some tweezers to do it because the tape is very very thin and my nails were kind of thick so the tweezers helped a lot um, and then you're just going to um, peel it back slowly to release that sticky residue there and then you just want to um, stick it to your skin pretty much and you definitely want to apply some pressure maybe for like 30 seconds um, before releasing it just to make sure it's sticky um and then i'm going to go ahead and move over to the next side and basically do the same thing also i do want to mention that it may be difficult to peel the tape while the wig is on your head so if you need to take it off and uh, peel the little blue tape forward a little bit then put the wig back on your head you can do that as well that's what i had to do um just to make it easier on you and then so once both sides are sticking i'm just going to press both sides down again apply a whole bunch of pressure not too much like sing a little song maybe for like 30 seconds just to make sure they stick now i'm just taking out the front rollers and i'm going to pin back my hair in the front because i'm going to be using my um my hot comb just to push back the um, hairline in the front just a little bit because I want to spray the rest down yes I did use the uh, wig tape for the ends but I want to just spray it down with some like spray adhesive for the rest of the hairline to make sure that sticks as well <music> Thank you. 
All right, so after about like five to 10 minutes, well not five to 10, like 10 to 15 minutes, I'm gonna take off this wig band um, cause I was letting my edges sit and then I'm gonna take out these little rollers in the front because I'm um, gonna comb through the curls now. So only thing I did was use a wide tooth comb to gently separate the curls in the back and you see the body in this hair because honestly I would not have expected that like because look how the curls came they came like that but once you curl like curl once you comb through this the wig comes to life the volume in this hair is sickening like I have never I'm gagged gagged okay because the volume in this is just simply amazing it is huge so big and let's get into the curtain bangs because they complement these curls so well when i say like this is the best like fair faucet 70s big fluffy vintage curl type look if you love that look this is definitely um the wig for you so this really made me super excited and then it's really thick again it's like 220 something percent density i told you at the beginning um so it's very very it's like it's as thick as it looks this is not this is not an illusion it is exactly as thick as it looks um so really quickly i'm just going to take my cream makeup and a flat top brush and go across the hairline um just so it can blend in with everything else but honestly besides that this style is done like it comes pre-styled i didn't have to put not a curl in it i didn't have to touch up anything i didn't even want to like trim anything because the ends were blunt cut perfectly so there's nothing else that i had to do here but look cute but y'all when i tell you run to get this wig run sprint don't jog don't walk. run and get this before they sell out because this is so cute i can only imagine this in the fall with like a thick chunky sweater and some cute jewelry anyways the hair on this is immaculate i didn't have and with all the curls in it you would think you had issues with like tangling no i had no issues with tangling shedding anything like that like as you can see i'm running my fingers through these curls like effortless effortlessly and yeah it was it was amazing um love this love this wig love this look for me um all the information for this hair of course will be in the description box below any question comments concerns whatever leave it in the comment section and yeah that's it for this video you got, check this wig out check it out just check it out um but yeah thanks so much for watching this video adios till next time